Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Raina. If you're new here, then welcome. Today I've got the Look Fantastic Beauty Chest here with me to unboxing with you guys all together. I literally received it yesterday and I did open up, had a look because the box came with, was very fragile and one of the cream was the cap and the bottle was separated. Like it wasn't spilling or anything, but I don't know how that happened. Anyway, I cannot wait to unbox this with you guys together. I bought their advent calendar last year and then I didn't really enjoy it, so I decided not to go ahead. And of course, because I bought an advent calendar last year, I didn't get the beauty chest. I just don't want to spend like, a huge bunch of money at one website. Um, but I really enjoyed their beauty chest last year. I saw people unboxing like I really should get my hands on and obviously they sold out. So I just went on purchase straight away when I saw this one this year and I'm actually really really impressed by everything that came with the box. I feel like if you like a beauty event calendar type of thingy for the holiday but you don't want to spend that whole bunch of money for the whole advent calendar for 24 days this is actually really good anyway without further ado let's just dive into today's video if you like today's content don't forget to give me a like and consider subscribe down below i do have a few advent calendars already unboxed so i'll leave the link up i i believe it's this way and the cards and down the description below and i've got a few that i'm um, planning to unbox with you guys very soon as well so if you don't want to miss that maybe consider subscribe to my channel this is a like, but also because I just subscribe. <laughs> Without further ado, let's just open this. So I actually quite enjoy the box design. You open up this way, so you um, have your first drawer sort of here. I'm thinking either replace this with a adhesive mirror to make this more like a jewelry box or like, I don't know, a box if I want to do makeup or put on skincare, maybe put it somewhere, I'm not quite sure. Like if I want to do a mirror here, or I can just do some adhesive like a wallpaper thingy tap it over, um, cover it and I can write my own words if I want to or I just you know leave it as just pattern without any words. And then you can pull up, this is the second drawer. That is why I think it's going to be super good for jewelry box and if it's for a jewelry purpose then I will do the mirror thing here. The first product here is a makeup. We've got the Hourglass a translucent setting powder. I actually wanted to try this one for a long, long time. In Australia, we do have a brand called the Murrows Prefer. They have a very, very similar product, and I always want to see if this works exactly the same. So I'm super happy receiving this one. And the size is two grams here. Perfect for travel, but you can also use for a long time. I mean, two gram for setting your full face. Seriously, you can use it for a while. And then let's just get all the makeups out. Maybe that's a better way. I have a Bioterry Lip Gloss here. I don't know why they didn't give like a paper packaging on top so I can see the shades and everything. I don't know, this in French. I can't speak French. Um, I swatched it. It's kind of like a clear sort of lip gloss or like a lip treatment. I'll leave the descriptions down below like the number of product I'll copy and paste from the website so you can have a look and then we've also got this oh this is not makeup oh this is actually mm, I don't know this is Mali Grow Strong Brow Oil so it is aiming to grow your brow make it more strong is it a roller form or is it a brush form uh, it's a roller form so I guess I just go all over my brows and it will go strong and also grow oh. It's an interesting product, something that I would definitely not purchase myself, but I actually do want to try it. Alright, do we have more makeup? I think we do. I remember there was like a Kevin O'Clon product here somewhere. Yes. We've also got a Kevin O'Clon, the, Vol the Volume Mascara in the shade Black. This is a 5 gram product here. This is the one that got mixed with that cream, so I know there was a bit of cream on the packaging. Oh, I like their slim. Like for a mascara, for such a slim feeling, like a pen. This feels like a eyeliner to me, but it's actually a mascara. It has one of those very slim brush and wand design. I love this packaging. Kevin O'Clon has my favorite packaging from time to time. Not all of their products, but a lot of them I really enjoy. Um, and then I think we also have a lip liner. Yes, this is the brand Ico Linden Precise Smart Proof Pinch Black Liquid Eyeliner. It's a felt pen tip. Yes, it's similar to the ones I'm using at the moment. I'm using the Quick Flick. What is the name of this one? The Quick Flick Eyeliner that I'm using at the moment. Oh, so one side got a stamp, one side got a pen. 
Yeah, it's very similar finish. This is in my project paint at the moment, but I can surely use one of those eyeliners. I love these eyeliners to do on my little out wing, although I don't do it perfectly. And I believe that's everything for makeup. We've got one, two, three, four, five. And the brow, you can consider as makeup or skincare. It depends. I mean, if you don't do makeup, you still won't have your natural, nice brow growing, right? So now let's move on to something in between, which is this uh, Glove Satin Sleeping Mask. So this is the eye mask that you put it all over in when you go to sleep. I personally don't use one of these. My sister got one as well for her birthday. She loved to play with it, but she doesn't use it. I don't know, I love receiving one of these and I might actually use this when I go on travel. Like if I'm on the airplane because long distance travel from here to China, I do actually want something like this. But for day to day normal life, I wouldn't use it. Like I'm happy just without it. And then a cleansing product. This can also be classified as makeup. I don't know. I kind of sometimes think a lot of cleansing products are more designed for removing makeup than they're considered to be a makeup product. But you know, if you do sunscreen, this can be also used. This is the uh, Avlon Cleansing Oil Capsule Tribal Case. So we've got, let's just open this up. So here's everything. We've got a travel case and then we've got the capsule separated. So I guess you just put it in like how you do your pills for the seven days one, but it's just like around the design. You put your captures in here and then you can use it. I can see myself using this for other things as well. If I have little small earrings, I can put it in here. They have a little one, you can hear it. But it was so easy to be pushed. Like if you're in your bag, it's going to be super easy to open by accident. But I do like the design and I do like the capsule here. The color is very pretty for a cleansing oil capsule. Alright, that's an interesting product. Another one of the things I wouldn't purchase myself but I'm very happy to give it a go and try see if I love it. Moving on, let's see what else we've got. I just want to open this Murad one first. This is their clarifying oil free water gel. We've got in a 47ml size. This is their step 3. This is moisturizer. I do have a what is called travel pack that I bought from Colt Beauty. So they have like a little cleanser, a little moisturizer and a serum maybe plus a like SPF day cream, day cream with SPF. Ooh, I love their packaging. I've got a few Murat products here, but I haven't actually started using it. Maybe this is a good sign for me to start testing them out and I can give you guys an update. I'm sure a lot of people have already reviewed Murat many times before, but I want to see how it feels on my face. And now we come to the cream that came in separated. This is the Pry 24 Gold Wrinkle Repair Cream we've got in a 30ml size. So when it came, the cap of this one wasn't on top of the bottle. It was actually closed the wrong way to the cap. That is why they couldn't close it properly. And I don't know why it was like that in the first place. So some of the cream here was getting the color of this wrapping paper, so I just scooped them out. I mean, mainly it doesn't make a huge difference, but if you receive it as a gift to yourself, like a treat, you definitely want to receive everything in perfect condition, and this was not the case. And then the last one from this bottom drawer here is a very heavy one. This is by the 111 Skin Antioxidant energizing essence we've got a hundred ml you can see because of the cream they put all this color transferred all on this packaging again i don't mind it but i want to let you guys know look fantastic packaging has been a trouble for the recent year i believe the few times that i bought every single time there was a little bit of something it wasn't big enough for me to complain but it was that bargain you this is a beautiful glass bottle. It reminds me of the SK2. I mean, to be honest, the Caudalie one also looks like this. One of these essence is going to be really good for the morning time when I want to just have refresh my skin before I do my serums. But if this is going to be essential, I'm not quite sure. I might be super, super enjoying it after use it. And that's why I bought this box. All right, moving up. Um, I see this as a hair product, so we'll talk about this later. Um, elements. I love elements and I love receiving elements rather than buying it myself from the beauty event calendars. I've got one of the elements collagen day cream or night cream from the looks fantastic event calendar and then another one the other one that I received was from ASOS event calendar. They seem to be corroborating with elements every year. So this one we've got the pro collagen eye reef 
mask, anti-wrinkle multi-use eye mask. So it says we do a thin layer to the eye contour, leave it overnight to absorb, or you can layer it and or over makeup. Oh, and or all over makeup. And we have to use it as a minimum of three times to see the good result out of it. I'm not planning to use it over makeup, but I think I can use it under makeup as an eye prep primer. But I'm really keen to use it as an eye mask because I don't have as many eye masks compared to my facial masks. So I, yeah, that's going to be very interesting. And then the last one on the list for the skin face show care. This is the Avrila Linden. I probably got a name wrong. So revitalized night moisturizer. We've got in the size of 30 mils here. So this one comes with a lot of probiotic ingredients here. A lot of probiotic proteins here. So it's, I guess it's like anti-wrinkle, moisturizing, super moisturizing. It looks like a little candle packaging. Just smell it. Mmm. Oh my gosh, it was oh it was one of the face wash that I used before. I cannot remember the brand. It was a super super affordable one, but it was just like that brand. And I think they have aloe vera in it, that's why they have a similar scent. I'm sure it is a really good brand, and that's also the other reason why I want to buy advent calendars or beauty chest from different companies because I've never like I just don't know all the brands of course and this gave me the chance to try and dive into it. The last but not the least is the Christoph Robin serum for the hair. This is a regenerating serum with prickle pear oil to smooth and deep nourish the hair. We've got in a 50 ml size. It's particular for dry and damaged the hair. I don't have either of the problems they described, which is a good thing for me, but oh, I love this packaging. Look at this color. So we use it after the shampoo and their mask to apply a small amount daily on the length on damp or dry hair. So I guess it's mainly on use at the tail of the hair. I can definitely use it. I mean, who doesn't want to have the perfect hair condition and who doesn't want to keep it that way? Because I've cut my hair short, if you remember from early this year's video, it was short, short. I actually really enjoy short hair. So much easier to deal with. Wash it, dry it, style it, perfume it. I don't even have to worry about tearing my hair up. Now I do have to think about what hairstyle that I pair. And back in the days when I have short, there's only one hairstyle you can have and that's it. I love that. <laughs> Anyway, that is everything. I actually really, really enjoy this box. I bought it because I know I love everything. Like there's nothing absolutely going to be a no-no for me. I mean, the eye mask is probably my least favorite, but I can still find a use and it feels super, super good. Like it feels going to be a super nice quality one. If you do enjoy an eye mask, you're probably going to be enjoy this brand, this particular one. But yeah, everything else with the makeup, there are a few I really wanted to give it a go. And for the moisturizer, there's some that I know I'm going to love, some I'm happy to give it a try. And for the hair, I mean, this is a perfect brand. I love their deep clean um, sea salt shampoo, their rose paste as well. I love those two. One for volumizing, one for deep cleansing. They're perfect. Really good brand. So yeah, if you want to get your hands on this, I think it's still available at the time of filming this. Finger crossed is still there when I uploaded this. And I really hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to give me a like and consider subscribing to my channel. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!